Now, <coughs> the uh, this is a morphology of bacterial cell. Now it has got parts. The when bacteria undergoes uh, hostile condition, comes across hostile condition, it goes for sporulation. Some of the bacteria have outer covering called capsule. Bacteria is made up of cell wall and cytoplasmic membrane, and then these are ribosomes. And this is cytoplasm, there is a bacterial nucleus and these are inclusion bodies and ribosomes, plasmid, inclusion body, cytoplasm, membrane, spores, flagella, capsule, embryo, nucleus, ribosome, plasmid, inclusion bodies and cytoplasm. Now, <coughs> coming to the bacterial cell wall, uh, bacterial cell wall is made up of peptidoglycan, it is made up of n acetyl muramic acid and it has glucosamine held together by a dipeptide chain and it is 40 times thicker in gram positive compared to uh, gram negative and it has got magnesium ribonuclease and thicoic acid and uh, inner side like a tube of a tire it has got a cytoplasmic membrane which is a which harbors the respiratory enzymes and controls the inflow and outflow of the inorganic and organic solutes and these are small granular structures these are called Ribosomes, which are the which are which synthesized protein. Bacterial nucleus is consists of single molecule of double stranded DNA, and there are inclusion granules. It is very helpful in identification of bacteria called Corynebacter and bacteria. They are situated at the poles. They are a polymerized metaphosphate. There is small extra DNA material called plasmid transmitted from one bacteria to another bacteria process of transduction or conjugation. And uh, two important properties: drug resistance and toxicity. And uh, <coughs> this is a colloidal material, consists of cytoplasm. Colloidal material consists of uh, inorganic and organic solutes. Now, some of the capsulated organisms, which is made up of protein, anthrax, of carbohydrate in uh, pneumococci. Uh, hostile conditions: it undergoes uh, sporulation. And spore bearing organisms are Clostridia, which form spores in absence of oxygen, and anthrax is made up of uh, uh, anthrax is aerobic conditions, uh, anthrax bacilli. Spores are uh, resting stage of bacteria, non reproductive stage. Flagella is an organ of locomotion, depending on other means for flagella, they are classified into a tricate, monotricate, peritricate, amphitricate, and logotricate. Now, depending on the arrangement of uh, spores, central non bulging. Central bulging, terminal, uh, terminal non-bulging, terminal bulging, uh, terminal bulging, terminal bulging you see in Clostridium and Pitani and gives rise to drumstick appearance. L forms are formed uh, when cell wall is lost because they are found out in Faster Western Institute of London. When you go in the presence of uh, penicillin, they lose cell wall. Protoplast in gram positive and gram negative, spiroplast in gram negative and they lose cell wall. And uh, this is in nutshell. The morphology of bacteria. So, uh, bacteria is a simple prokaryocyte compared to uh, non uh, eukaryocyte is human cell. It, it lacks endocytoplasmic reticulum, Golgi apparatus, and simply it divides by simple binary fusion. Time taken for simple binary fusion is uh, generation time. Remember as 2020 cricket, 20 minutes for E. coli, 20 hours for tuberculosis, and 20 days for Mycobacterium leprae. And uh, simple divides by it lacks uh, nucleolus and nuclear membrane, and uh, it lacks the Golgi apparatus. It, it does not show cytoplasmic streaming. These are the differences between. Uh, eukaryocyte and prokaryocyte. Now, uh, now coming to the cell wall, cell wall is made up of peptidoglycan, it is made up of NS, NAM and NAG. Now, n acetyl muramic acid and n acetyl glucosamine held together by dipeptide chain and uh, it is 40 times thicker in gram positive and uh, gram negative has more of lipids and it has got outer membrane which is made up of lipid. That's why during setup uh, gram staining when you dissolve, you use a decolorizing agent, it gets dissolved. And it has got a colloidal material inside, uh, it is cytoplasm. It is cytoplasmic membrane which harbors the enzymes which is essential for 
aspiration. Pectal nucleus is simple that made up of single molecule of double strand. This is single molecule of double strand DNA, and uh, and it divides by binary fission. Plasmid is extra chromosomal genetic material present in cytoplasm, not essential for survival. At, uh, it replicates autonomously. It is transmitted from one bacteria to another by transduction or conjugation. In gram negative, it is conjugation. In gram positive, it is by transduction. The ribosomes are the uh, place where proteins get synthesized, bacterial proteins get synthesized. Now, capsule, capsulated organisms are pneumococci, made up of uh, carbohydrate and uh, protein in anthrax. When you put specific antiserum, capsule swells up. It is called as capsular swelling phenomenon. Capsular swelling phenomenon. Now, spores are formed under Hostile condition, they are resting stage of bacteria, they are very essential that they should be killed during sterilization procedure. They are, uh, and the examples are in, in presence of oxygen, anthrax, in absence of oxygen, Clostridium, Clostridium. Clostridium, three species, Botulinum, Titani, and Welchi. Please remember uh, the spores can be central, non bulging, central. Bulging, subterminal, non bulging, subterminal, non bulging, subterminal bulging, terminal bulging, non bulging, terminal bulging. Terminal bulging you see in case of uh, Clostridium titani, that's why it gives rise to drumstick appearance. Flagella is an organ of locomotion demonstrated by hanging drop, wet cover, uh, that is indirect method. If you see motile, it's flagellated and Proteus forms swarming in blood agar. YouTube, Drake's YouTube, hanging drop preparation, electron microscope, high phase contrast microscope can visualize it. Depending on the element of labella, you are classified as tricate, example cocci, monotricate, vibrio cholerae, peritricate, enteric organism, amphitricate, pseudomonas, tuft of flagella at one end or both end, spiral of minus. So, this is in simplified way of uh, uh, the uh, inclusion bodies are seen in uh, Cornebacterium diphtheriae, which are polymerized metaphosphate. They are polar granules, waves are nest granules, and uh, this is 2020 of uh, morphology of bacteria. Please, uh, while going to the viva examination, you should remember important plots, spores, example of spore bearing organism, Clostridium and anthrax, example of capsulated organisms are. Uh, Pneumococca and anthrax, flagellated organisms, Salmonella, E. coli, Klebsiella and Shigella are non motile, non flagellated. All enteric organisms are motile. Fimbria, Gonococca is fimbriated. It helps the organism to get attached to the human host cells, helps in the pathogenicity. Nucleus is simple, single molecule of double strand DNA, ribosome, protein synthesis, plasmid, extra chromogenetic material induced into important property, drug resistance to toxicity. Inclusion bodies, uh, especially in Cornebacterium diphtheriae, they are situated at the pole, they are called as polar bodies. Polymerized metaphosphate, phosphate, voltine granules, metachromatic granules, stain with special stain called Albert stain, user stain, cytoplasmic membrane, like tube inside the tire, cell wall is tire, and it controls of influent outflow of the inorganic and organic solutes. Please subscribe my channel, Suresh Gogi, hit the bell icon whenever I, I you have to prepare for your neat and next and that's so uh, to become a licentiate practitioner you should pass your neat and next this is very important that you should be competitive so mark questions can be asked from i will prepare you for the neat and next examination thank you very much